Hello everybody, it's Ashley with Soap Dr. Soaps and we are here to restock our lavender soap. So in here I have my oils and some goat's milk powder and uh, kaolin clay which I add to my soaps to help hold the fragrance. So I'm going to blend that up real quick and we'll get started. I have added some titanium dioxide to my lye water. And I'm going to pour that down the stick blender. And in my lye water, I have a little bit of sugar. I have sodium lactate, which, which is a salt derivative that helps the bars to harden. And then that titanium dioxide and I also have dissolved a little bit of Tessa silk in there. Lavender essential oil with just a touch, little little scotch of orange to sweeten it up. Alrighty, so I am going to pour a little bit of this off in here. Probably a little bit more than that, about that much. Because I am going to do purple, a layer of purple on the bottom. And this is a nice, beautiful, strong purple. So that's why I added the titanium dioxide because I don't want it to be quite that vibrant. I want it to be a little bit more muted. Scrape those sides, make sure it's all mixed in. Try and stir out some of those bubbles that I made. Alrighty, so here's my mold. Make sure you guys can see that. Just pour that down in the bottom. My lights nearly fell on me. Hopefully you can still see. So I have a little tea strainer here. Just gonna put my gold mic in there. Tap it along. So I'm going to do a little bit of more of purple, just a little bit. Okay, so here is our remaining white. And we're going to do an in the pot swirl. So, here's our purple. I'm going to move this way a little bit so that I get my light. Okay. Okay. So here's our other one and I'm going to put my spatula in the way so I hopefully don't break my mic. Purple mica mixed in oil and 
some gold mica mixed in oil. I'm gonna do that to half. This is just a new design I came up with in my head, so we'll see if it looks good. I've seen it done similar to this before. That is the finished wet soap. I'll bring you back tomorrow for the cutting. Alrighty, here is the finished loaf of the lavender. Mm -hmm. And you can see the line here. Let me show you on the side. And as you can see, it's a little bit yellow in the middle, but that will lighten up as it's exposed to the air. Let's see, we've got our purple down here, our gold pencil line, and then our in the pot swirl. And here's the top.